What's up guys? JiveMonkey125 here with the first official episode of our Pokemon Ruby Randomized Nuzlocke. Thank you guys so much for your support on the uh, Choose My Starter episode. So many views, so many comments, so many likes. Blew me away. Thank you so, so much for that. But looking at the final tally, I, I reloaded so I could go back to this. The three starters that we had, we had, again, Ponyta, Spoink, and Nosepass. Coming in third, with the least amount of votes, was Ponyta. So the best starter option that we had. Then came options one and two. Now it was close between Spoink and versus Nosepass, all right? We had some people on the Nosepass side. We had some people on the Spoink side. Fuck those people, by the way. There were people that were really, really wanting each option. There was a battle in the comments, but coming in second was Spoink. So, our starter is Nosepass. And oh boy, do we have a fun fun nickname for him. Hopefully you understand it. And I know it's a Poochina still, alright? The game doesn't let you randomize that. Don't, don't hate me. Oh, he knows the move. So, for those who didn't know, Spoink had Splash. And only Splash. And that was it. It knew no other moves. So Nosepass is our starter on the layout. I think technically we can't really put him on yet because it's not officially ours yet. Whew. I was in ta the tall grass studying wild Pokemon when I was jumped. You saved me. Thanks a lot. Oh, hi, you're George. This is not the place to chat, so come to my Poke come by my Pokemon lab later, okay? So George, I've heard so much about you from your father. I've heard that you don't have your own Pokemon yet, but the way you battled earlier, you pulled it off a loaf. I guess you have your father's blood in your veins after all. Oh yes, as thanks for rescuing me, I'd like you to have the Pokemon you used earlier. And we officially now have the Nose Pass. While you're at it, why not give a nickname to that Nose Pass, of course. So, I know we had a Nose Pass in Soul Silver that we named Stiff. People didn't want me to nickname it Stiff. There were some people who did. Don't be wrong, there were people in the comments who wanted me to revive Stiff, but I think this nickname is better. So if you ever watched the show The Wild Thornberries, Nigel Thornberry, the father, looks just like a nose pass, and he loves to say smashing. So it kind of works, the smashing and the whole joke from before where, you know, hard bone, whatever. Smashing the nose pass. If you work at Pokemon and get experience, I think you'll make a darn good trainer. My kid, Brendan, who's a nerd, has a stupid hat, is out on Route 103 studying Pokemon. Might not be a bad idea for you to go see Brendan. What do you think, sure? Great! Brendan should be happy, too. Get Brendan to teach you what it means to be a trainer. Do you give me anything? You don't. Alright, so let's mosey on our way. We're not, we might get an encounter today. I don't really know. It really just depends on how quick we can go through all the beginner shit. This is Route 101. So we aren't going to get any encounters yet. We don't have Pokeballs. We don't have a Pokedex. The Nuzlocke has not started. There are Pikachus. Nice. Smashing is going to beat the hell out of that thing. Now, I'm just seeing if there's any, like, potions or anything. I don't know what's in the routes. Again, randomizer. I'm going to turn my music down just a little bit. So I don't know if there's going to be anything, like, overpowered in the grass. Anything we need to be nervous about. Like a Kyogre! Okay, so if we find Kyogres, we can live one Water Pulse if it's not a crit. Good to know. And we don't have to worry about this game failing like uh, Soul Silver, where I had to continually save. Yeah, give me a potion. Thank you. There would be fucking Kyogres in the first route! Now, that'd be a cool encounter to catch, but, like, no. It knows poison's thing. It would poison me. You know what? We have a potion. It, it knows double kick. Okay, that's fine. We died. But, like, again, the Nuzlocke has not started yet. So this is why we're going to get some... We're gonna get some levels up really quick. That's gonna kill me. It's gonna... Yeah. We're gonna die a lot. Alright, so... This is fine. This is why the Nuzlocke has not started. But yeah, I'm not sitting here fighting that thing. Why are there so many, like, strong Pokemon?
Like, I just want to get to, like, level 8. Stop with... Please let me run. Thank you. Alright, I think I want to train down here. I just want to get to, like, level 7 or 8. Nothing fancy, nothing crazy, nothing nothing special. I can't even kill a shuppet. Alright, if we can just fight Pikachus, that'd be great. Because Pikachus aren't scary. Feraligators are. Like, what is this shit? What is with all the power? I, I'm okay with it because it's going to be nice for encounters, but... Clefairy. Can, can we just get a Clefairy with our encounter? That way I can actually catch it. Because, like, I don't want to get anything that's going to kill me. Like, because that's my worry, is we're going to die. And I know I'm speeding up a lot. Alright, I know that we're doing that. But I need to get some levels, okay? Because just a nose pass, perfect. It can get hard now. Just a nose pass is not going to be enough. Especially when this Nuzlocke starts. So we need to get to level 8. And then we're going to progress. But we know some things that we can get. We Stop with the Feraligators. At least we know the Kyogre is a very rare encounter. So I don't have to worry. I, don't get me wrong. I would love the Kyogre. Trust me. I would love a Kyogre. I don't want to fuck with a Kyogre. I really don't. This is just going to kill me. And it's going to be really annoying speeding up all the time at the start. But it's the first step... Oh, we can live that. Give me another one of those. No, not you. Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna go forward. Cause I don't think if if if, Ma if Brendan has a spoink, obviously it can't hurt me. And if Brendan has the pony talk, it can't hurt me. Stop it. Stop it, Septile. Now I can stop speeding up. We're level eight. We have some levels. We have some clearance here. All right. I don't have to worry as much about getting one shot by an encounter. Look, it's the worst evolution. Oh, this thing's way too strong. Like, it's so much defense. And we have such a low attack. This is gonna be a struggle. It's not like the last series where we had a Cresselia at the start. Okay. So it's this one and that one that live on Route 103. Hey, it's George! Oh yeah, Dad gave you a Pokemon. Since we're here, how about a little battle? I'll teach you about being a trainer. What being a trainer's about. Please have a spoink. I mean, either one. Like, the Ponyta can't do much either. All I can do is tackle me. That's fine. So, Brendan's gonna have a Rapidash later in the game. This game is so slow. I forgot how slow this game is. I just need to turn up the speeds on battle animations. So, I don't want to speed up too much, but... Especially in relevant things. But I want to get this series done before November when Sword and Shield comes out. And this is just a tackle contest. Holy, that was a crit. This Ponytaw's going to tackle me one more time. Good thing we are rock solid smashing these Ponytaws. And that should give me another level. 162 experience. Perfection. Smashing grew to level 9. We have such a low attack. Huh, George, you're not too shabby. I don't know what voice he is. I think I get it. I think I know why my dad is I eye out for you now. Look, your Pokemon already likes you, even though you just got it. I get the feeling that you can befriend any Pokemon with ease. We should head back to the lab. Let me actually look at jo uh, Smashing. He's holding something. He has a Fex Spore! That's so freaking cool! If stuff hits us physically, we can put it to sleep, potentially. That's so awesome. It's holding TMOA. We'll see what that is. Um, we are a rash nature. Hey, Google! What is Rash Nature in Pokemon? Let's take a look. That is not at all what I fucking searched. So I'm gonna search this up because I don't know what Rash Nature is. Rash Nature Pokemon. I'm actually curious too. Rash Nature. Of course it doesn't fucking show me what it is. Come on. Show me what I need. Rash nature. Rash, rash. Plus in special attack, minus in special defense. So completely pointless for a fucking nose pass. It knows tackle and harden. But I'm curious what TMO8 is. 
Watch it be Rock Smash. That'd be hilarious. Takedown. Please learn it. Damn it! That would so helpful. Alright, and the sound's gonna go off for a second. I... Actually, no. I'm dumb. Options. Fast. So we're gonna run back down. We're gonna get our Pokédex. And we are going to get some encounters. I don't care what you say, Brandon. I really don't. I don't care. I just want my encounters. So today's Friday. Start of your weekend. Hopefully your week went well. The, uh, the new iPhone is available for pre-order today. So if you want the new iPhone, you better fucking buy it from me. Urge to beat Brandon on your first try. This is excellent. Brandon's been helping with my research for a long time. Has an extensive history as a trainer already. Here, George, I drew this for my research, but I think you should have this Pokédex. Sick! Pokédex. Now it's the balls. I don't care about the dialogue. I really don't. Get a Pokédex, too. Here, have some balls. Cool. Pokéballs. Awesome. How many you give me? Like, five or ten? Please, ten. Five. Five's okay. And hopefully we get running shoes. Because if I don't have running shoes, I'm going to lose my freaking mind. Mom. George, George, did you introduce yourself to Professor Birch? Oh, what an adorable Pokemon you got it from Professor Birch. How nice. Here, have some shoes. Cool. Fuck off, Mom. I can run! Am I healed? I'm not. I'm going to make sure I'm fully healed. Mom! Mom, give me health. Mom! Thank you. I appreciate you, Mom. Thank God I made it so you can run inside. I would have lost my freaking mind. Alright, so Route 101. Be the Pikachu! <sighs> I don't know if I should actually try to fight this. Because I don't want to die. Because if it water guns me, I might just die. Computer, stop making blinks on my left screen. I gotta run. I, I, I know I'm giving up an encounter. I know. But I have a nose pass. Alright? I can't... I have to play smart. Watch this be the Pikachu. Why could it have been the freaking Pikachu? Or the Clefairy, even. <sighs> Alright. So let me buy some items. God, it's all my money. Yikes. They don't give you that much money at the start of this game, do they? Alright, we're gonna buy two potions and two more balls. So we have seven Pokeballs, four potions. Oh, please. Please be decent. It knows double kick. I'm gonna harden. And hope it doesn't hit me with- If it double kicks me and I die, I swear to god. Okay, it's asleep! Okay. Harden again. And we're gonna tackle it. Perfect, okay. So I'm gonna heal. Oh, and Nita Queen will be so clutch. And I know exactly what I'm naming it to. Double kick, don't crit me. It still does five, are you serious? Let's go, effects four, two for two! Oh my god. I wanna heal again. I wanna play smart. Okay. Nidoqueen, you're asleep, you're in the red. Pokemon logic tells me you're capturable. One, two, three shakes. Fall asleep. Okay, you're not asleep, you're still in the red. I need this. I really need this. Fuck. If it crits me, we're dead. Fall asleep. I'm gonna waste all my potions in this random battle. I don't like tail whips. Oh my god, I'm already stressed out. This is the first episode! Stay in the ball. Please be caught. I've never been happier on a capture in my entire Pokemon career. That we caught that Nidoqueen. Nidoqueen's body is encased in extremely hard scales. It is adept at sending flow flows. 
foes flying with harsh tags. Pokemon at its strongest when it is defending its young. She four foot three. She a thick girl. So, we name all of our Nido Queens after a beautiful, beautiful woman. All of our Nido Queens are Lisa Ann. Please tell me you understand what that comes from. Yes, it's pornography. <laughs> Alright, so let's see what Lisa Ann looks like. Trace copies the ability. That's kind of cool. Quirky nature. I don't feel like looking that up. It looks like it's neutral because everything's 10. Scratch, tail whip, double kick, poison sting. <sighs> I want to level up Lisa Ann a few times. This is probably gonna be like a 25 minute episode because I want to get through the basic stuff. Septile, I don't see Absorb hurting me that bad. Perfect. We can destroy these things. I'm gonna speed up some. Porygon, double kick. Oh, I love you, Lisa Ann. I love you and your beautiful, beautiful buxom body. Oh, this made my Nuzlocke so much better. Now, I'm not gonna not use uh, Smashing, don't worry. Smashing will be used. But I'm using Nido Queen more. Heck, all of you. That's gonna explode. They have run away. That's badass. And Trace will be nice too because I can see what type. Not, yeah, what type I'm. Or not type. My, what ability I'm uh, fighting against. Alright, so how many Pokeballs do we have now? Four. So I can get my encounter now, or I can do a battle. And I don't seem see getting that much money from this. Let's just do the battles before we do. What's the harm in getting some money? We'll do our first official battle that's not against Brandon and his stupid hat. You have an Aaron. You have an AA Ron Rogers. And you're dead. Lisa Ann goes to level 9. May and Mia. Khalifa. $80. That's nothing. Hopefully we can get through these routes without any battles, because I want money. Oh look, a Spoink! It's gonna know Splash! All of you out there who voted for Spoink, heck you. I feel like we had the much better encounter. A Roselia, beautiful. We'll scratch that too. Scratch! Absorb does nothing. Clear apart poison type. At least Anne's already level 10. I love it. Alright, we're gonna try and get through this grass. Wish me luck. Let's go! That's some hype right there. Clam Pearl? With Intimidate. That's hilarious. If it knows water gonna kill me, I'm gonna cry. Don't kill me. That did nothing. Yay. Heck you, Clam Pearl. Goldeen? I'm, I'm literally gonna use Lisa. Lisa Ann is so powerful. Like, people don't realize how strong the Nidos are. Like, Nido Queen and Nido King are. Why am I holding speed up? Why am I being dumb? There's nothing over there. Play smart. You're better at Pokemon than this. I wanna battle you. What am I doing? I'm gonna keep winning. Help me further my career. Cray Dilly. Why'd I scratch it? Double kick it. Level 12. Kakuna? Smashing, it's your time! Alright, so I'm just gonna hold down the speed up button while we tackle this cunt. Alright. Beautiful, 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 beautiful. And at least AM wasn't holding anything either, so I don't have to worry about that. Let's heal on up. And then we're gonna meet the best character in this game. How much money do I have first? Actually. Can Lisa Ann learn takedown? She can't, so I'm just doing this. Uh, takedown is okay as a move, but I'd rather have money. So I can get more balls. Perfect. I have no more money. I have no idea what's in this route. Please just don't be a water type that's strong. Please.
Didn't encounter, goddammit. Okay, I'm in the grass. Why are we getting no encounters? Thank you. This technically isn't dupes, or is it? They're not, they're not dupes. It's not dupes because we have a Nido Queen. This is the other Nido. We can have a Nido King and a Nido Queen on our team. Okay. That's actually pretty lit. Peck. Peck you. And you're asleep. I'm not even gonna risk it. I'm just throwing balls at its chin. Pokeball. No. Now this is gonna be a longer episode, just FYI. Because I wanna get through the encounters here. Hey, we got the Nido King. Um I know the perfect name, since we named Nido Queen Lisa Ann. We should name this one Johnny Sins. Oh, it's not gonna fit. I mean, if we make it one word, it'll fit. Johnny Sins. God damn it. Why is this what I do with my free time? What what else was in here? Other than the Nidorino. Kevin Durant was here. Skiplins were here. That would be kind of a cool. That's a dick trio. I'm getting out of there right now. I'm not, I'm not messing around with dick trios. Really not. Alright, what is Johnny Sins' ability? Marvel Skip ups defense and suffering. Okay. That's kind of cool. It might help us late game. I can't go that way. Yeah. Yeah, to the gym. Whatever. Sup, Dad? Huh. Well, it isn't George, so you're all finished moving in. I'm surprised you managed to get here by yourself. Oh, I see you're with a po- I don't care about any of your dialogue. Wally! That's who I wanted. The most timid. This is literally the epitome of Dabnik. Starts off very timid and very nervous around people. Becomes a god shortly after. Um, I I I'd like to get a Pokemon, please. Hmm. You're uh oh right, you're Wally, right? I've been going to stay with my relatives in Ver Verdant Turf Town. I thought I would be lonely by myself, so I wanted to take a Pokemon along. But I've never caught one before. I don't, I don't know how. Hmm, I see. George, you heard that, right? Go with Wally. Make sure that he can safely catch a Pokemon. Wally, here I'll loan you my Pokemon. It's not really Zig's gun. Oh well, Pokemon. Hmm, I'll give you a Pokeball too. Go for it. Oh, wow, thank you. Would you really come with me? Simultaneously. At the exact same time, we will go. Walking slow, walking slow, because this generation's slow. Walking slow! George, uh, po Pokemon hide in tall grass like this, don't they? Please watch me and see if I can catch one properly. Alright, let's see what this randomizes do for him. It's a fucking chin chow. <laughs> okay. He got him a choke me daddy! Of course the character's dad would give him a choke me daddy. Oh please. Please macho have like huge power and just completely kill this chin chow. Do over half. Oh. That's no fun. I like when the game glitches and the encounter dies. That's always fun. Yeah, you, you click A. And you catch a chin chow. Alright, so you literally have the perfect opposition for my team because I have a rock type and two ground types. My team is just decimated by water. I I did it. It's it's my Pokemon. George, thank you. Let's go back to the gym. So, did it work out? Thank you. Yes, it did. Here's your Pokemon back. George, thank you for coming with me. You two are why I was able to catch my Pokemon. I promise to take really good care of it. Oh, my mom's waiting for me, so I, should, I have to go. Bye. I don't care, Dad. Fuck off. I'm gonna get bad. Just be better than you. I want to be the very best. No one ever was. Two more encounters. We're going to get these two encounters, and that's going to be the end of this episode. It's a long episode. It's the first episode. That is awesome! That is a freaking Ampharos. I want this on my team. Okay, please stay in the ball. Why would you get poisoned? A freaking... When effects for affects it badly. 
Let's go. That is so strong. And now keeping with the usual trend, when we catch something super strong, we have one and only one nickname for it. And that's Hung Solo. Tala, that's right. You get a, you get one early in this game. We have plenty of room. Okay, Hung So Low. Right, I need to heal it though. <laughs> Make sure we can get back. All right. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. We're fine. Oh, let's look at the Ampharos. What typing do you have? And it's holding something. Has synchronized, so if we get status, they get status. As you saw, when it got poisoned, we also got poisoned. It's holding a Rossberry. The Snozberries taste like Snozberries. Speaking of berries, let's give some berries out. You can hold an Oranberry. You can also hold an Oranberry. The team's coming along well! We now have our alternative to water types. And we have one more encounter. Alright, we avoided that trainer. We'll battle him in the next episode. Do not fret, my friends. But we need to get our Petalburg, Petalburg Woods encounter. And I want to get this item. It's not a Master Ball. Okay. But before we get the encounter, there's an item down here, and I want to put it in my bag. Because it's a Master Ball. Damn it! I will do that one day. One day I will call the Master Ball. I did it in Pokemon Yellow in the first episode. After we failed on five encounters. God, that was such a pain in my ass. Let's see. What is our last encounter going to be? It's a Meryl! Yes, that's a perfect water type. Why'd I tackle it? Use defense for it. Do it again. Don't go crit. Motherfucker! Alright, so we have four mods on the team. The team is looking great. Actually, I'm gonna go this way to get out. Nerd. I just wanna get... We can add an Altaria. That would've been awesome! I just wanted to get smashing to level 10. Since he was right there, holy his defense is high as hell. But let's go back to the Pokemon Center and end off today's episode. Now going forward, episodes are only going to be 20 minutes, about. Anywhere from 18 to 22, depending on battles and such like that. I wanted the first episode to be a little bit longer. Get those encounters, get the startup stuff done. But that's where we're going to end off. If you did enjoy today's episode and you're looking forward to this series, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe if you've not already. Almost to 100. I think when I last looked we were like 83. So almost to 100 subscribers. Can we get there during this series? That'd be awesome. And make sure, comment down below. Um, just let me, I don't know, fucking tell me something. Tell me what you think about our, should, should I have ran from the Feraligator? How about that? Should I have ran from the Feraligator or should I have tried to catch it? Let me know in the comments below. I'm going to name Pokemon after people in the comments. So, if you want to have a Pokemon named after you, you should probably freaking comment. Other than that though, I will see all of you beautiful people next time.